Hey everyone, my name is Daniel O'Grady and welcome to another Wasabi Cars video. I'm doing good, how about you? Okay, so uh, guys, it's the last week of school in Japan, so I've got four more days. I think Friday is a day off for some reason. I don't, I'm not sure why, I don't really care why. But uh, yeah, it's warming up in Japan, I'm feeling much better. It's sunny, blue skies today, so rare, so rare. Um, and also one more point before I get into today's car, which I think you're going to enjoy. Um, should I be putting my face on thumbnails? Now, I mean, my face is not all that much to look at, but you know, basically I've got this car picture. It's all very, you know, car-like and uh, people probably look at that and go, oh, okay, I'll check it out. And then I start talking and people might be a bit dis disjointed, like what's going on here? So, you know, I just to sort of, you know, know what they're getting into, my face and then the car as well on the front. <laughs> Enough of that. Um, now, I want to show this car today for a couple of different reasons. Oh, the car Mitsubishi GSR VR, and it is of course a Starion. I'll talk about that name <laughs> in just a moment. Now, there are two reasons, to, uh, two people I want to, uh, to, to mention, because one of them is Roberto Buen Rostro who in my Cosmo video mentioned uh, Seinfeld memory. He saw a conquest. That's one reason uh, why I'm showing this car. And another reason, and the main one actually, is Mark Ernest on Facebook. So g'day Mark in Minnesota. Well, that's where you um, saw a car show with a couple of these. Oh, it was a big Mitsubishi event in Minnesota, right? From last April? From last August. So yeah, thank you very much for that video. And um, finally a response almost a year later. <laughs> okay, the car, let's check it out. Yeah, Starion. Now, I just want to talk about the name Starion. There's some joke like, um, or some urban myth, you know, it sort of comes from stallion, as in the horse, and because the Japanese can't pronounce it or it got mispronounced or it was miswritten. I don't think it's as simple as that, even if it could perhaps be true, yeah, because even in Nostalgic Hero magazine, I regularly see RL mistakes. So, it does happen. But I mean, I'm sure there were lots of checks and lots of market research. Is Starion the right sounding name? I mean, there wouldn't be just like someone, oh, Starion, and everyone's going, yeah, sure. I doubt that very much. What do you think? Sounds like BS, that it was just simply a mistake. So yeah, this is a wide body, and wide bodies were built from, I believe, 87 to 89. Now, this one doesn't have any badges. And uh, it does have, well sorry, it does have a turbo badge and it has a, a very interesting badge, a USDM badge, Conquest, imported for Chrysler. So that's a very odd thing to see on a Japanese car. Having said that, you know, there is definitely a trend, you know, people love to have USDM parts, just like they like to have JDM parts in America or in Australia. The opposite is happening here. I guess it makes sense. But, um, Oh, well, and there is that one other badge on the car, and that would be a Mitsubishi, the three diamonds of the Mitsubishi on the front. That's a fine looking car, and uh, I'm just going to take this opportunity to take a breath. <sighs> okay, and let's check out the rear on the uh, hatch, the rear hatch. It's got the, uh, a spoiler, spoiler? Or a, 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 a visor of some description at the top there, sort of interesting. Again, there's a Mitsubishi sticker. Not a badge, is it? No, Mitsubishi Motors. Okay guys, well I think I'm pretty much done. The question of the day, question of the day is uh, school related. As I said, it is the last week of school here in Japan and I have a couple of memories from my high school days and the last week of school, the last day of school. A fella called Scott, who I won't mention his last name or the school we went to, but he had a yellow Volkswagen Beetle. He put some oil down in front of, on the road in front of the school jumped in his bug and uh, spun the wheels <laughs> and then I hope I got this right this was at the end of school in 1990 December 1990 and then he repeated the year came back in 91 <laughs> oh man that spins me out that is hilarious g'day uh, if you're watching of course Scott hope you're well um, yeah, okay, I'm done guys, so thank you very much for joining me. Hey, and if you are on Facebook, check out Wasabi Speed. It's a new page, it sort of hasn't really gone far yet, but uh, if you're into newer cars, racier cars, sportier cars, do check it out, okay? Thank you very much everyone, goodbye, see you.